Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Um, last night I got pushed 10.69.2.3 to my car and it seems like I was probably one of the last ones in the beta program to get it. We're gonna give it our normal morning drive to our place to get caffeine and then my place of work. Now, and then we are going to see how this version goes from there. So let's go ahead and get started. What's new from past videos is this road used to be unmarked and now we have full marks and uh, the car seems to be a lot happier as a result of it. You also might notice that I have a new camera. Um, this is a 360 camera and I hope that if things happen outside the peripheral vision of uh, normal type of driving we'll be able to pan around and see what's going on. So um, let me know in the comments if you like this camera or not and uh, we'll go from there. Coming up on a right hand turn, cross traffic is going 55 miles an hour. There is a light. Sometimes it goes on red, sometimes it doesn't. We'll see what it does. We have a creep wall, we are going. Whoa, and it went into the far lane. And there's a car right behind me, so I gotta give it some juice here to speed up. Um, not sure why I did that, we'll go ahead and report that. I like that it went into the far lane, but because uh, we're gonna be making a left hand turn, but. Um, it does, uh, it, did, it was questionable why it should have done that. All right, we have a red light. That braking was a little harder than I would like. One of the things, there's a false left-hand turn up here for future development. It often wants to dodge into that. Last time it did not do that, so let's go ahead and see what it does. It did not. It did not dodge in there, so we're all good. We're making a left-hand turn. Cross traffic does not have a light. It is 55 miles an hour. In the morning, this can be somewhat busy. We'll see what happens. We have a fair amount of cross traffic. Really, what technically I'm where I can be, but dang, that was close. Um, did not have to be that close to the oncoming traffic. Left turn was smooth, was really smooth once it did make the turn, and it did find a proper hole to find its way out. Coming up on a right hand turn, it says a drop off to the right. Let's see if it comes in hot or not. No traffic. Nice slow down signal. Slow down into the turn, which is actually really nice. That was a really good job. Cross traffic here. Didn't even slow down because it knew it wasn't going to be a problem. Um, standard autopilot. My wife's Model Y has standard autopilot and it is super, super sensitive with cross traffic being way far away and jamming on the brakes. FSD has definitely address that in a good way. All right, it's pretty much a straight shot up to the place of caffeine. We will check back in when we are all caffeinated up and I will head to my place of work and we'll finish up from there. All right, we are all caffeinated up and we are ready to go. Go ahead and gauge. Nope. Nope. There we go. Sometimes I have trouble getting out of this now parking lot. To 7th Avenue. This time it scooted right out pretty easily. Couple of, couple of lights ahead of us. It's never had an issue with this in a long time. I 
kind of as expected with it being a, a very low point bump in the beta. I haven't really noticed much in the way of any major changes. Right, we're coming up on a right hand turn. We're doing 45, 50 miles an hour uh, when we get to the bottom here. And, uh, it's a light. Sometimes it's green, sometimes it wants to cut this uh, right turn a little wide, in my opinion. There's a left hand turn lane, which it almost wants to clip cars that are coming out. The car in front of us, so we are slowing down quite a bit because of the red light. We are going off to the right a little bit. We have a creep wall. And we did hesitate for that car. Good job. And we are going. So, Creep Wall was did a perfect job of letting me know how far out it was going to go, and it appeared that it was going to go. And we had a left-hand turn. The person making a left-hand turn in front of us that it decided to pause for. So, good job. So, that is FSD Beta 10.69.2.3. And overall, pretty solid update. I would say no big changes, but that was kind of expected based on the point release. And uh, although it doesn't appear to me that there were any regressions either, although I have spoken with some people and they have gotten it before I have and feel that it's worse than it was before. So every situation is different, but uh, for me here in Iowa on that particular drive on this particular day at this particular hour um, it worked out really well so that's FSD beta 10.69.2.3 in the books so we'll put out more videos as new updates come out so if you like this video you want to see more FSD videos or review videos or road trip videos um, swing over to my channel hit that subscribe button um, and we have videos like that coming out all the time so Till the next video, safe driving.